Welcome everyone. Today we're going to be installing the top side of the trunk. This is going to be divided up to three parts. So we're going to be doing the top side, the emblem side, and then the bottom side. Uh, today we're going to do the top side, which will be anchoring one side and then the other side, and then we're just going to stretch down. With that being said, let's go ahead and continue. All right, and once you have your the rear all clean, make sure you lay the PPF film on top, spray some slip solution underneath. All right, and we go ahead and start peeling it. And we're just gonna place it down, squeegee out any water underneath. because we don't want it to move. All right, so let's go ahead and start peeling. All right, once you have it peeled, just go ahead and lift it and add some slip solution. Once you have it squeegee it out, once you have the spray solution on it, we're gonna go ahead and align it and squeegee out any water. Okay. So let's go ahead and start on this side. All right, so on this side, I don't know if you can see it, it sort of has like the straight angle. You sort of wanna put it to the edge as much as possible on both sides. Have it evenly be distributed. Once you have it down, you're gonna hold it and just squeegee out. And remember, whatever you do on this side, you're gonna do on the other side. All right, once you got most of it out, you're gonna peel back and add some tack solution. Add some on top so your squeegee can glide. All right, so now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Okay, and now for this side, you're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna move it around and if it gets stuck, just go ahead and lift it and add some slip solution. Right. And if you have any dirt underneath, you should be able to remove it with your finger. All right, so let's continue. And again, you're gonna put it at the edge on both sides. Hold it, squeegee out. Okay, now you're gonna lift it and add some tack solution. All right, we're gonna move on to the bottom side of the pillars, and we're just gonna stretch down until you don't see any fingers on this side. Just gonna stretch down. And then just squeeze out the water. Okay, once you have this side done, you're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Okay. Then lastly, we wanna go ahead and get the middle side down as much as possible. And then just squeegee out any excess water. All right, so once you have the metal section uh, stretched and in position, we're gonna go ahead and start tucking in the edges. So what you wanna do is you wanna grab your towel and just add some tack solution. So you have the ability to glide your towel around. You wanna wrap your towel around with your squeegee 
and then just try to tuck in the edges. If that doesn't work, go ahead and grab your heat gun and then just add some heat. All right, so just follow along this pattern next to the windshield and you should be done with it fairly quickly and then you're just going to move in onto the inside strip of the pillar and remember everyone this is the last step so just be patient take your time and just make sure every part is tucked in and once it's done just wait a couple more hours and come back to it make sure that it doesn't lift again and if it does, just go ahead and start doing the same method again until everything just wants to not want to lift up anymore. All right, and that concludes the installation process. Just to recap, we started on one side, we moved on to the other side, and then we just stretched down. Uh, the next video is going to be this side. Uh, we hope to see you there. And if you have any questions, comment below. Thank you for watching.